What is going on everybody? I'm back making another video and in today's video we are doing Doggy to Pegasus Day 38. I just finished Doggy to Pegasus Day 37 yesterday and my friends are telling me get on, get on, get on, hurry up and claim your profit on Safari Dogs before they drop and I, I really just started thinking like why would they drop with 370 exist? It's more rare than the butterfly. And the butterfly gets like three and a half trillion. So if it's more rare than that, if it went limited right now, huge safari dog would be getting like four trillion. So I, I don't know why it would drop. I guess if it doesn't go limited this week, it will. But yeah, I was telling my friends like there's no reason it should drop. I don't really want to just cash out and miss out on a bunch of extra profit. But I think I'm just not going to be greedy about it because as much logic as I want to apply to how rare the pet is, pet some extra kids just don't have much logic and they're kind of the ones that just run the economy i saw people in big games like i have no clue why alpha thinks that safari dog should be worth more it's not even a pet that costs money or anything like I, I don't know people just come up with the weirdest arguments i mean it's not my fault the pet's super rare it doesn't have to cost money to have value there's a ton of pets that have a ton of value that don't cost money like just look at bread sheba or hot dog or anything Pets can have value without costing money. But yeah, I already did a couple of trades to start the episode off. I think this is where I ended the episode, is whenever I bought a final few safari dogs. And then I ended up trading Lucas. I gave him my shiny mystic corgi, and he gave me a bunch of stuff. He gave me five huge butterflies, and also a gold huge butterfly. And then he threw in a shiny safari dog. And then, like, a bunch of these other random pets are like super teamwork so he gave me like 34 trillion worth of stuff like just the butterflies alone are worth so much each of these butterflies is like three and a half trillion almost half my inventory is just butterflies because of how valuable these are but yeah i'm thinking of just cashing all this stuff out because it all rose and it might be a good idea to just take my profit because if i just take my profit i'm still making like over 10 trillion between all the safari dogs and the butterflies butterflies combined so like a whole free titanic profit i shouldn't complain i shouldn't be greedy so yeah i think i'm just gonna take my profit but after the trade with lucas i bought another safari dog at 1.25 and then another at 1.25 oh yeah lucas also gave 3.5 trillion gems i forgot that part of the trade and then i just started selling off all this random stuff like 250 billion for a gargoyle dragon then i bought another safari dog then i sold this sold this I pretty much just went through and sold all this stuff, and I actually forgot to record whenever I was selling all this stuff in the booth. I have the other trades on recording, like the big trade with Lucas and buying the Safari Dogs, but I, I didn't get all this stuff selling on camera. But these are like Super Teamwork Hell Rocks, so I was able to get overpays for a lot of this stuff. Super Teamwork Skeleton, Teamwork Hell Rock, Super Teamwork Enchanted Deer, and then the final thing that I did is I bought one more Safari Dog for 1.3 trillion last night and then I went to bed. So yeah, I think I'm just gonna sell all this stuff and my friend told me I really, really should just quit risking it and take my profit and get a blobfish because a blobfish would be an even better investment because recently blobfish and hippo melon used to get like four to five titanics and hippo melons are so rare now because most of the owners aren't trading them that a hippo melon got over 11 titanics multiple times and i just had a hippo melon i mean i didn't have a hippo melon i had a blobfish the other day which is just as rare it just gets a little bit less so the point is i think i'm gonna try to get a blobfish again i literally just had one like two episodes ago and i traded it away for like four titanics and ads because that's what it was getting at the time and yeah it was kind of a bad decision should have held on to it but i'm gonna try to get another blobfish if i can get a blobfish for like five titanics worth or something and then maybe i could get like like eight titanics worth of stuff for it i mean the hippo melons getting 11 titanics i don't know why blobfish wouldn't get a pretty similar amount they both have like exactly 60 exist or 61 or 62 but yeah now that you guys know my game plan you've seen all my trades that i did last night after the previous dog at a titanic episode now 
it's time to get into the video. So yeah, this is my inventory right now, everybody. I'm pretty sure I have like at least 70 trillion worth of stuff. So I have like seven Titanics worth of stuff. And uh, yeah, time to go find some more trades. All right, everybody, I'm going to just trade three of the Safari Dogs off for 4.3 trillion. So I'm getting 1.433333 trillion for each. I'm going to tell them to hold these because they might be worth four trill each soon if they go limited. They literally have less hatched than Butterfly. 130 less hatched than Butterfly. And everyone knows what Butterfly is getting. Like, literally, if these went limited this update, they would be getting like four trillion. So I just got to hope they don't go limited this update. Or, or I could just hold on to a few of them. I could just hold on to like four or five just in case they go limited soon and rise to like two, three, four trillion. Dude, there's a 1.2 safari dog right here i'll take that thank you very much i literally just sold three of them for 1.43 i'll take one for 1.2 it's just a little bit of extra free profit for me oh another 1.2 thank you very much <laughs> i guess i'll just buy all these back i got a couple more for 1.2 all right we got a couple safari dogs back made some profit off of them all i gotta do is sell them again for more expensive and we just get even more profit All right, everybody, sorry my mic was muted for that previous two trades before. All I did really was buy two safari dogs because they were under a trillion. So now I got 14 safari dogs again, but I'm going to be giving four butterflies for a titanic balloon monkey. He also wants me to sign his rainbow chess mimic collection. It's kind of a cool collection, so I'll just sign it. All right, sure. But yeah, I only gave like 2.45 or 2.5 for each of these butterflies. I got a really good deal for these last week so i'm pretty much only giving 10 trillion for a titanic balloon monkey and titanic balloon monkeys can get like over 13 trillion easy so i'm making over 3 trillion profit off of this trade i only gave like 10 trillion for all these butterflies and i can easily get over 13 for the balloon monkey all right let me give him his chest mimics back all right there you go i'm gonna trade this guy one more time because he's got another titanic balloon monkey that i kind of want to get oh dang he doesn't want to sell his other balloon monkey all right, that's fine. I got two Titanics. That's all I really need as of right now. Let me put my own signature on this. All right, nice. Now we got a Jolly Cat, a Balloon Monkey, and then still a whole bunch of other stuff. But these Safari Dogs are going to be really good investments. So I'm not really worried. All right, somebody just bought a huge butterfly for 3.25. Like I said, I bought most of these at like two and a half trillion. Ooh, two of them sold. I actually can't hold any more gems. I gotta deposit my gems real quick. All right, now we can sell more. All right, nice. We just sold the third. All right, now that we have a ton of gems, I think I'm gonna just go all in on Safari Dogs. 1.1 trillion. If I can't find something for cheaper, I'll buy that. But there are some people selling for under a trillion right now, which is crazy. Like, I just sold four Safari Dogs for like 1.44 trillion the other day. I don't know why they went down like over 35%. Ooh, 1.03 trillion. I'll buy that. 995 billion thank you very much that's a steal i've got no problem with getting more safari dogs all right let me withdraw all my gems we got 8.44 trillion let me look for some more safari dogs i'm gonna just hoard these for a long time i'm gonna wait until they're about to go limited or until they actually go limited because if they go limited right now with 374 exist they would literally be worth over 4 trillion even if they had double the amount exist which probably won't happen because the game gets less and less players and less updates now than when it first came out like even if it had double the amount exist it would still be as rare as in jealous and get at least 2 trillion so yeah i'm gonna buy for 1 trillion or less all day here's a 1.1 trillion i think yeah i'll buy it oh he's trading okay i might come back and buy it let me see if there's any more for under a trillion Ooh, here's a bunch for a trillion these are all mine i'm taking them a trillion is a good price i hope nobody else comes over here and takes these i want to buy all of them please nobody else take these all right we got three i really hope nobody takes the fourth one. Oh, you're doing this too fast Yes, we got all four of them. <laughs> we have so many safari dogs. Like, I literally just sold a bunch 
just the other day at the beginning of this video for almost 1.5 trillion so I i'm gonna buy him back for a trillion it's like a bitcoin dip like I i'm buying while it's low i know that it's gonna go back up even if it had double the amount exist which isn't going to happen it would still be as rare as huge and jealous getting over two trill that's why I'm buying so many safari dogs. There's literally no reason not to. Another one trillion safari dog. This is so free. Why are nobody else buying these? There's literally nobody else buying these. Like, one trillion is a good price. They were already getting a trillion from collectors before they rose. Like, they went up to 1.4 trillion and then just went straight back down to 900 billion to a trillion. For no reason. They rose 500 bill and then they dropped 500 bill. Kind of crazy. Yeah, collectors were already paying a trillion per safari dog before they even rose. So I'm going to get as many of these as I can. 1.1 trillion. You know, I would buy that if there weren't so many for a trillion or less. I've already gotten like seven today for a trillion or less. Seven today, more, more like seven in the past 10 minutes. Like this is literally so easy. 950? Dude. Why would you sell for that low? Like, that's just crazy. Thank you very much. All right, another one for 999. Thank you very much. It has Chestbreaker 2 also. That's not even a bad enchant at all. All right, a 1.35 trillion super teamwork safari dog. Come on, I, I kind of want this. All right, nice. We got it. I'm going to just lock the super teamwork one just so I know which one is super teamwork. I don't want to accidentally sell it for less, but I'm not going to be selling these for a little while anyways. I got 24 safari dogs now. I bought most of them at around a trillion each, but if these could start getting like two or three, maybe even four trillion if they went limited this update and no more got hatched, just imagine how much value I would have. I would have like a hundred trillion just in safari dogs alone if these went limited this update. But let's say that the minimum they're going to be worth is two trillion. I just want to add up my value. Value. So Jolly Cat gets like 14 trillion right now, and then Balloon Monkey gets like at least 13 trillion. And then let's just say, worst case scenario, Safari Dog starts getting hatched like crazy, which probably won't even happen because there's way less players on the game and updates are only twice a month. But let's just say that Safari Dog gets hatched like crazy and double the amount get hatched. So there's like 740, the same number as in Jealous. Safari Dog would still be worth over 2 trillion, even if double the amount started existing. So at the very minimum, I have 48 trillion worth of Safari Dogs, because I have 24 Safari Dogs. So let's do plus 48, and then plus a shiny Safari Dog, which should at its peak get at least like 3.5 trillion at least. And then the rainbow should get at least five. And then the gold butterfly also gets like five. So I have like 88.5 trillion value. I can almost afford like nine Titanics. I made so much profit off of the butterflies and the safari dogs already. And that's obviously when safari dogs go limited. But that's only calculating the 24 safari dogs if they had double the amount exist. If they only had like another 100 or 200 exist, they would still be worth like 3 trillion or almost 3 trillion. So I could have over 100 trillion value already just with what I have. I just gotta wait for Safari Dog to go limited and hopefully it goes limited really soon because then Safari Dog's gonna be worth trillions. Pretty good progress so far. We're like almost halfway there to a crowned Pegasus. This is actually crazy. Like I'm doing such big trades that I just make trillions profit all the time. I mean, the bigger your trade get, the bigger your profit gets. I bet the super good guys in this game, they probably make like multiple Titanic's profit all the time with huge, huge trades. I don't know how else these guys have this much. They, they must be making so much profit. All right, everybody, I'm going to give my Titanic Jolly Cat for 13 Safari Dogs. Uh, I mean 12 Safari Dogs, not 13. My friend Frog actually offered me 13, but I waited a little bit too long to take his offer. I told him I wanted to keep a couple of Titanics, and then I changed my mind, but now Safari Dogs are worth even more. I think they're getting like 1.1 trillion at the very minimum. Like, it's hard to 
find one for 1.1 trillion so yeah they've been going up all by themselves so i think people are anticipating them going limited soon so yeah i have i've got 36 safari dogs now okay who is breaking stuff that's so loud okay i'm gonna i'm gonna walk over here and talk so yeah i have 36 safari dogs now i had 24 and i just traded for 12 more i'm really really banking on these going limited soon because right now 36 safari dogs times 1.1 trillion is only 39.6 trillion but if these go limited soon with the amount exist 36 times 4 this could be 144 trillion value if these went limited right now with only 374 exist and i honestly think that they're gonna go limited really soon they've already been out for a few months just like safari cat like these really could go limited soon so i'm i'm just betting heavy i'm putting all my chips on the table but even if double the amount exist somehow if somehow double the amount exist even though they've barely been getting getting hatched the past couple updates like literally just a few were hatched even if somehow double were hatched i would still have over 72 trillion value in just safari dogs plus my gold butterfly and my rainbow safari dog and my shiny and my titanic balloon monkey so no matter what i pretty much almost have like 100 trillion value uh, if I, if Safari Dogs go limited soon, I'm literally gonna have, like, enough for a Pegasus. I literally will have enough for a Pegasus if Safari Dogs go limited, like, right now. So let's say Safari Dogs just jump up to 4 trillion value, because there's under 400 exist. 36 times 4, and then plus a Golden Butterfly that gets, like, 5 trill, plus a Rainbow Safari Dog. If these are getting, like, 4 trill, a Rainbow would be getting, like, 10. And then the Shiny would be getting, like seven or something and then plus a titanic balloon monkey yeah we're gonna have enough for like 17 or 18 titanics if huge safari dogs go limited soon we'll have 178 trillion value all right i guess it's time for some more trades i guess i should probably trade away the golden butterfly because it's not gonna rise much more and i guess i can do some flips with the titanic balloon monkey because i really just don't want to trade these safari dogs and until they go limited and they rise like there's no point in trading them away right now for barely over a trillion so yeah i guess let's flip the golden butterfly and the titanic balloon monkey and then everything else i can just hold on to until it goes up all right everybody sorry that this video took so long to get out i've been moving the past four or five days i've had most of this footage ready to go for a while i just haven't been able to upload it when i wanted to i wanted to upload this video like five or six days ago but i've literally been busy all day every day for like the past four or five days but there's one thing i want to check on before i end this video i want to go and see how many of the new titanic there are because i'm pretty sure there's only like seven days left 84 titanic cats in the first entire week i might try to trade for one of these it's only a little bit less rare than Blobfish and Hippo Melon, and with 84 hatched in the first week, I'm guessing there's not going to be more than another 80 hatched. There's probably only going to be like another 50 tops. What, what was that? Oh, the claw machine. Yeah, I might try to trade for one of those. They're going to be at least like three times as rare as the Jolly Cat, because the Jolly Cat has a little over 500 exist, and there's no way that this is going to have over like 170. There's literally just no way, unless everybody's starts hatching it like crazy on the last few days or something so yeah i might try to trade for one of these i feel like it's going to be like three times as valuable as jolly cat but yeah that is pretty much it for this episode i hope you guys enjoyed this is everything i have as of right now i think i have like 36 safari dogs and then a rainbow a shiny a golden butterfly and a titanic balloon monkey and a pretty good amount of safari dogs got hatched last update but i'm still not worried there was like 80 or 90 hatched because they were getting super hyped up and rising in value so obviously everyone's gonna try to hatch some but i really don't think that they're gonna be out for that much longer so even if a few hundred more get hatched even there even if there's like seven or eight hundred exist it'll still be about as rare as angelus which gets over two trillion so these could very easily still double in value even if there's a couple hundred more hatched so i'm gonna hold on to these i don't care what anyone says I'm holding out because I know they're gonna make profit. The only way that they could stay at a trillion value is if like another thousand got hatched and there's just no way that's gonna happen. So 
I'm gonna hold on to my safari dogs for a little bit longer, and I'm just gonna trade with my golden butterfly and my titanic balloon monkey. Unless I can find the new titanic cat, then I might give some safari dogs for it, if I can make some more profit off of the cat. But yeah, like I was saying, that's pretty much it for this video. Sorry this video took so long. I wanted to get it out almost a week ago, but like I said, I've been moving. So yeah, do not worry. A lot more videos coming soon. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button, comment some ideas for more future videos down below, and subscribe if you have not already. I'll see you all in the next one very soon. That claw machine's messing up my outro. Peace out, everybody.